Well, this is our little magnet motor project. Uh, well, this is what it started out as being. Uh, we printed two cogs, um, two gears, should I say, which are the same size, same pitch, etc., etc. Uh, so the idea was to have two counter rotating um, drums with magnets on it, which are these ones here. Um, both had the 10mm hole through the centre. So the idea was to put a shaft through the two and um, <coughs> as such. And our uh, magnets were going to get glued around each rotor. <coughs> um, then we had our stator, which has the cutout in the bottom to sit over the gears. And of course our stator magnets were getting glued around here. That would sit in there like so. And when, all to, when it's all together, things are supposed to spin. So, um, been a change of plan. We've gotten rid of all this garbage here. Too many bits and pieces. Um, going for an upgraded design. So I've just finished drawing up and uh, that's the machine's printing the first one out at the moment. Here you can see I've included the bearing hole uh, in there it's to take a 8mm uh, by 22mm bearing, 8mm thick, it will sit in that recess. Um, same on the bottom, another bearing in the bottom, and um, the drum is now fixed, is one part. The uh, drum and the cog is now one part, and you can see I've left the flat sides on there to glue our magnets on rather than making the drum round, so, uh, which I did with the early ones. They're all flat sided for our, uh, oh, up in the picture, for our magnets to stick on. But um, these ones are uh, 90 millimeters in diameter. One that's on the printer at the moment is 125, so we're going a bit larger. A um, couple hours of printing there to go, but um, it's up and away. And uh, like I said, that uh, one piece will be much easier to work with. Where we just plonk two bearings in, one top, one bottom in each um, drum, and uh, we simply fix the pins into our base plate and everything rotates together but the machine the a net a8 cheapest one i could buy at the time i've done a review on it the video before is uh still printing out perfectly and even the names oh, well, yeah, even the names in the uh, gears are coming out very nice and meshes absolutely beautifully Trying to keep you in the pitch here. So uh, yeah, the machine's growing, going very well. But yeah, that's our um, updated version. We'll call this a trial run. I may even put it together one day. But um, to make things easier, we're printing out two of these instead. I will then have to print out a uh, larger stator because of our uh, now larger gear which has increased by um, 35 mils in diameter <coughs> so that's where we're at at the moment it was all go full day's printing been going on here but uh, we're doing an upgrade so before we even get the uh, base model done uh, otherwise too many bits and pieces to put together line up um, then i have to build a base plate it's going to hold two bearings so it's easier just to uh, redo the two um, drums, the two rotors. Right, that's just the update on our build so far. And um, yeah, we'll keep on going. And next video, I should have the assembly put together. Give it a test spin, see if it works all right. Magnets aren't going to be here for about a week. 
so uh, we've got plenty of time to get everything sorted out as far as our two drums uh, meshing together, our base plate built with the shafts in it, all ready to go. Thanks for watching guys and uh, we'll see you for the next update.